Hello everybody, it's Boaz Weiler and I'm here with the Daily Astrology Forecast for April 15th, 2016. So, Georgia and me uh, think it's going to be an amazing day. Uh, there's the Moon in Leo and it's trining Mars and it's trining Venus and later on it's trining Saturn. Great aspects all along, you know. There are a little, there are a few corners we have to watch out from and we'll talk about it in a second. So, let's begin this day. If, if you are in Central Europe, you'll begin this day with uh, trying to Mars. It's a time that energy flows out more easily, we're more assertive, we can ride along the highway of life on a, in a higher speed and, and just enjoy the flow of energy in a, in a clearer and much more fluent way. And that's beautiful. Um, then there's a, trying to Venus. It's a good day to attract money. It's a good day to attract business. It's a good day in relationships both uh, in a work environment and in a personal environment. And it's a good day to bring back satisfaction, you know, in a sense, to be satisfied from what you're engaged in. And then later on, because that trying to Venus is really early morning America, early morning Eastern Standard Time, and it's noon time already in, in uh, Central Europe. And then it, the evening Central Europe, that's around 1900 hours, and around 1400 hours Eastern Standard Time, there's a trine to Saturn, which is also a major transit for the day. And that's a time that we are more responsible, we are able to carry the uh, chores and responsibilities that we're supposed to, with a smile, honorably, with a straight back, and, and, uh, and carry them with dignity. And in a sense, we're more uh, reserved and <clears throat> more mature. And this is very good for work and career environments. So these are all positive aspects. What do we have to watch out from today? There is a Queen Kong to Neptune at around 1300 hours Central European time. That's around 7 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's a time that we're more sensitive than usual and we could fall into victim mode very easily. Something doesn't happen the way we want it to happen, and then we start complaining. This happened to me, that happened to me. Why is everything happened to me, happening to me? So just watch out not to fall into victim mode uh, this morning, America, or noontime, Europe. And then there's also a square to Mercury at around 1800 hours Central European time. That's around 12 noon Eastern Standard Time. And that's a time that we could be very indecisive. So... Just leave big decisions alone today and deal with whatever needs to be done right now, right here. In general, Mercury <coughs> is trying Jupiter in the sky and trying Pluto. It's an expansive time in which we expand our consciousness and broaden our horizons and go deeper inside, beneath the layers that meets the eye and into the depth of the material that we're studying or learning or experiencing in our lives. So we, we've got the trying to Pluto that gives us a deeper look and we've got the trying to uh, Jupiter that gives us a higher, broader look. And those are two beautiful aspects influencing our thoughts and our words and the way we navigate through life. And that's a good time. That's a positive time. Uranus is still Queen Kong in Aegea. It's a time that we are asked to upgrade everything concerning our health. Health issues, healthy lifestyle, we need to update those specifications in our life right now and purify it, the, the, our daily routine from things that don't belong in our future anymore. So. Thank you for listening. I hope you have a positive day. This is Boaz Fighter. George and me are saying goodbye. Take care.